Hey guys, uh, this is a small video recording for payout links. In this, basically, I'll be showing how to call the APIs for payout links. Uh, primarily, we use payout links whenever uh, you want to create payouts, but you don't want to process the account information of your customers. The uh, one of an example would be refunds. In this case, you do not want the customer's details, but you want to process the refund for them. In that case, you can send them the payout links. Your customer will get a link. When he opens the link, he'll enter the, he'll get the options to add his account details. We will take that account details and in turn process the payout for you. So this is the API call that has to be made for payout links. The endpoint will be api.razorpay.com slash v1 slash payout links and you have two options to create a payout link one is using the contact details that is you can directly add the contact details for the person to whom you want to send the link or you can just add the contact id so so this will be our url We'll be making a post request. The auth type will be basic auth. And in payout links as of now can only be tested in live mode. So I'll I use my live mode API key and secret. Now we'll set the body type as raw and the text format will be JSON. We'll, keep, we'll copy the entire details present here. So this account number is the account number from which the money has to be debited. That is your RazorPayX virtual account number or your RazorPayX current account. So let me just uh, get my current account number, virtual account number. So this is my account number. I'll just replace it over here. And then uh, talking about the API, you have something called as a contact. This contact will contain the name of the person, the contact, their email ID and the type. This can be a customer or it can be a vendor. It is your choice. And then you have the option of sending. Then the amount has to be sent. Here the amount will be considered in pay So for example, if the amount is set to 100, it is actually 100 pay which is equal to 1 rupee. In this case, the amount is 1000. So it is 1000 paise which is equal to 10 rupees and then the currency will be INR. The purpose it is right now set to refund. Again this is a custom purpose and you can change it as per your requirement. You also have the op option of passing a description along with receipt which is again these two are just for your reference you can pass it. So uh, you know you can easily track something or you will be aware of uh, which payout link is for what and then you have the option of uh, send, uh, setting the parameters send sms true and send email true so if you set this to true we will send the link to your customer via sms and via email and finally you have the notes section again notes is for your reference you can add your uh, you know required values or for identification purposes now i'll hit on send So when I hit on send, in turn I get a payout link ID. So this is a unique payout link ID for this customer. And also we share the short URL. So ideally this is the URL that your customers will also be getting in case you set the send email and send SMS as true. You can also take this link and you can display the, uh, you can you know share the same link in your application as well and your customers can use that. So if we open this link,
you'll see that you will be redirected to this page where you'll have to add the details similarly let me just show you a small step where instead of using the contact details we'll just use a contact id so everything remains the same the only thing that you'll see is all the values in contact is replaced by a contact id here what has actually happened is we have created a contact earlier and we are using that contact so i just have a contact which was created earlier let me or let me get a contact from my razor page dashboard So I'll just use this over here. So everything remains the same. The only thing is uh, right now I'm just using a contact ID. So if you see, even in this case, the payout link was created. So that's all. Thank you.